This is Yusuf. Um, I got a message from somebody who was very short. It said, uh, uh, wake up, all religions are cults. Uh, they're all the same. It's some wording like that. Um, and then uh, something like, they're, you're all, it's, delu it's all delusional or, I don't know, I can't quote it exactly. Um, which, uh, is that ridiculous? Does, does anybody believe that? <laughs> is there any, um, is there any atheist on here that actually believes that all religions are cults? And I don't want to go back to the word cult where, oh, uh, in Spanish, it just means religion. They use it all the time. Or the cult of the Virgin or the cult of the saints or the cult of the martyrs or anything like that. Um, but actual cults versus religions. Cults are cults. Uh, not necessarily for their beliefs, although all of their beliefs are do have wicked and evil things in them because it's their behavior. It's the beliefs that affect their behavior. Um, well, I guess they're not really beliefs, but they're doctrines that are handed down by the leader. Um, and it's the behavior. Uh, do any Catholics or Orthodox would they are they kidnapped into the group um, are they not allowed to look at any any other religious material are they told to never look at anything negative of the church um, I personally think it's fun to go to other Christians who are critical of Orthodoxy although you can't really find many um, because uh, they don't know we exist, <laughs> and to just be like you don't know, you know, you don't know what you're talking about. But um, the children of God who um, say that we should send out, they they, they actually do and did uh, send out uh, women to sleep with men young women to sleep with men, to get all the money to go to the leader and devote their lives to the leader, David Berg. And uh, raising children in a, to have sex with each other and have sex with adults from the age of five, uh, to stand out on street corners and ask for donations to charities that don't exist, and it all just goes back to the leader. Um, to have multiple front groups to come to people and say, oh yeah, there's, you know, different front groups to get people to join. Um, <coughs> telling some, someone something completely different than what you believe, than what, what teach, has secret teachings. Um, get them thoroughly indoctrinated use brainwashing tex techniques like uh, keeping them away from their family, having these retreats, deprive them of food, have these um, uh, uh, chanting or constant babbling. I don't mean oh, you walk into a church and it's, you know, there's chanting going on there or singing. Uh, I mean the practices of if you ever have a doubt, you need to, you know, have push Satan out, push Satan out, or these other words, to, you know, just any form of doubt, you you kick it out, or any 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 pain, you just start doing that, so that you it cuts off free will. Uh, kidnapping fourteen-year-old girls and forcing them into the the group. And justifying it and saying, well, we, we did it for the greater good. Uh, 
saying, oh, no, we don't believe, you know, when people confront them, hey, do you believe X, Y, and Z? Oh, no, 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 we don't believe that, we don't believe that. And then after they've given all their money and are thoroughly brainwashed, they tell them the truth. You know, it's, it's, it's OT3 or something like that. Uh, and plotting uh, <laughs> the takedown of governments by trying to infiltrate them. Uh, I mean, all these things. The Orthodox Church, all the beliefs are openly displayed. Same as the Catholics, same as the Lutherans. Uh, it's not really the beliefs, it's the behavior you find with all these cults is the behavior stems from what the teachings are of the, usually one person so usually focused around one one individual it's just oh well you could say that about Jesus or this uh, he's not alive and living in a mansion uh, or have a mass of you know Five hundred women around him, constantly, or a fleet of limousines, uh, or saying you can never talk to this family member again. You know, where your parents, that old life. This is the new you, that old life. You playing basketball, uh, anything you like, you can't can't do that. Anything that's not of, you know, Sung Young Moon, is wicked and evil. Uh, <clears throat> uh, transcendental deception uh, saying anything you can to get the person to join and then after they're in you, you know after they're, you've fully broken them after you've deprived them of food you've had them of hours dancing uh, love bombing all this other garbage uh, you you know Make sure thoroughly all their defenses are broken down. This is something that normal religions do. Everybody's on an equal playing field. Because, you know, molesting children, uh, killing people, kidnapping people, uh, brain totally brainwashing people. And, uh, oh, people believe this or that, and that's stupid, or that's delusional, or that's not right. Is um, doing that of your, I mean, taking somebody who would never normally act, behave, believe, or anything like that, and then sh them having a massive shift and saying you can never question, you can never talk to your family ever again. And these groups say, oh, there's monks, and there's, uh, they can communicate with their family members. If you ever leave the group, you're going to die. Scientology says this. The Moonies say this. Oh, the Unification Church, I'm sorry. Uh, people standing out on corners saying, we're, uh, we're the government organization to feed children, to help needy children in the area. Uh, but they're not. They just bring the money back to the, you know, the organization. Uh, and there's no money distributed to the community at all. See, that's why I didn't, in, I didn't just say, oh, you know, I didn't include Protestants as an umbrella term. Because there's a pretty large segment in there, the evangelicals, where a lot of that activity can it's very, uh, televangelists act like that. And there's cults of personality around certain people. And I'm sure there's certain obscure unknown churches out there that do this. Um, and those are cults. It's the behavior. Not the belief. Oh, they believe in, they believe in a God, you believe in a God, therefore you're, it, they're all cults. Uh, no, a cult is by its behavior. Uh, it's not just some, oh, some obscure ritual. It's not even speaking in tongues, fine. But if you're, if you, they say you have to do this for 
four hours. And you have to use any time a uh, thought of uh, a loved one that you can't see anymore because that's just the devil tempting you. That's 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 the uh, you know that's that's Satan's world out here. We have the we have the new world in here, the the real world in here. <coughs> I talk about worldliness, carnal people, and spiritual people, and stuff like that. Uh, but there is, there's ne there was never a time I came to Orthodoxy or anybody else where it's been, oh, come, come join our uh, farm or our, our political meeting or our rally or our uh, band or, you know, whatever. And then it switches to a different set of beliefs. And that you can't reveal those beliefs. You have to tell people the opposite. You've aggressive recruiting campaigns. Uh, we're against proselytizing. It's openly condemned. Uh, so, kidnapping, the sexual abuse of children, lying about uh, doctrines, isolation, isolation from family and all friends, uh, destruction of anything that they did before they were in the group destroying all the writings that they did before they were in the group said that that's wicked and evil before they met the their true mother and father or the great leader or the you know whatever the hell David Miscavige is uh, holding people hostage starve you know all this stuff brain total brainwashing techniques to where you can get an intelligent nice person who would never normally do this stuff to do it saying if you ever leave you're going to die and it turns into an irrational phobia like when you see people who are horrified of like getting on an elevator and fear of death grips them and uh, you know they, they can't do it that's leaving the group they just they can't do it they can't do it and you actually have to have these people who are <clears throat> I don't mean deprogrammers in the way of kidnap people kidnapping them but just contact and say, hey, your family misses you, they they love you. you no, know, the leader says they don't, but they, isn't that, and I, I, did you go through my leader to tell, to have them, you know, contact you? And is there, there's, this, these are skeptical atheists that say this. You're a skeptical, rational atheist, and you say this. Really? They're all the same. This is how Roman Catholics act. This is how Lutherans act. People say, well, what about the terrorism in Islam? Subsection, really minority. Uh, what about, you know, what, what about any religious belief? This is why uh, Wicca, no, not a cult. Satanism, not a cult. Uh, You skeptical atheists, yeah. You guys, you guys are so much smart. You you're really smart. You really know what you're talking about. All religions are cults. Who makes a cult a cult? That is is its behavior. That's when you start calling it a cult. Uh, this is ridiculous. Well, all religions are cults. It's ridiculous. And then the people, but cult really means in the actual definition, well, how is it used? Submerged to me, means to go under and together. It was a fabricated word by Shakespeare. Oh, but the, we didn't mean to go underwater. It, it, it's jumping around. Um, so that's it. Um, I just think this person is beyond... To, well, just does not know what they're talking about. Doesn't, which I've, I've... And it's just these little attack things, like, wake up. It's almost like dealing with a cult member when you say something about Scientology and they, you're, you're brainwashed. Dealing with a Scientologist or a Unification Church or Job's Witness or people like this. Jehovah's Witness kind of less now, but yeah, they can't read anything critical of their church. Nothing critical of the church, no other religion. They can't. They can't even see it. 
really atheist? Uh, yeah, you, you're informed. Peace to you. May God save Serbia. Are they told to never look at anything negative of the church? Um, I personally think it's fun to go to other Christians who are critical of orthodoxy. Although you can't really find many um, because uh, they don't know we exist, <laughs> and to just be like, you don't know, you know, you don't know what you're talking about. But um, the children of God who. Um, This is Yusuf. Um, I got a message from somebody who was very short. It said, uh, uh, wake up, all religions are cults. Uh, they're all the same. It, 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 some wording like that. Um, and then uh, something like, they're, you're all, it's, delu it's all delusional or, I, know, I can't quote it exactly. Uh, well, I guess they're not really beliefs, but the doctrines that are handed down by the leader. Um, and it's the behavior. Uh, do any Catholics or Orthodox, would they, are they kidnapped into the group? Uh, are they not allowed to look at any any other religious material? The cult of the saints, or the cult of the martyrs, or anything like that. Um, but actual cults versus religions. Cults are cults, uh, not necessarily for their beliefs, although all of their beliefs are do have wicked and evil things in them because it's their behavior. It's the beliefs that affect their behavior. Um, um, which, uh, is that ridiculous? Does, does anybody believe that? <laughs> is there any, um, is there any atheist on here that actually believes that all religions are cults? And I don't want to go back to the word cult where, oh, uh, in Spanish it just means religion. They use it all the time. Or the cult of the virgin or the...